Minor League Baseball is live and on the air on the show. Coming up, we've got a good matchup in store between the Rocket City Trash Pandas and the Tennessee Smokies. Digging in, Zane Gerwitz. And we are set for baseball here this evening. Change up just off the black, and it's two and one. Right side, but it's going to be a foul ball. And we'll see some 40s before things are said and done tonight. Right now, 51 degrees at first pitch. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. hit pretty well out toward right center field long run for the right fielder he's there and records the first down into the box Roberto Baldacchin he's had 14 at bats in the series picking up four base hits Did he go around? No, he did not. Ball two. High in the air out to center field. Davis is back, and he'll get there to make the play for route number two. Standing in, no way. It's been a two for 14 effort for him to this point in the series. Pulled toward right center field. Center fielder on the run. He tracks it down, and that will end the inning. Now at the plate, Roberto Caro. He'll leave things off here in the bottom half of the first. The 3-1 is in there for a full count now three and two this is on the ground over to first oh what a stop on the slide it's there he got him and what a vital play there preventing the leadoff man from getting aboard one out nobody on count full three balls and two strikes Fastball blew it right by him, and there are two down. Now with the plate, Ian Rice is back in the starting lineup for this one after sitting out last night's game. Three and one. Two out, nobody on. And a good job there to lay off. It's ball four as he becomes their first base runner of the ball game now with two away. The third baseman, Christopher. One one it is high and outside for a ball. And he missed again, high and away this time. Three and one. He's having a really hard time finding his rhythm and finding the strike zone. It's going to allow this offense to keyhole him in big situations. He's got to figure it out pretty quick. And he misses again. Ball four. And that's back-to-back -back guys now that have reached base via the base on ball. Here's the payoff pitch. High in the air out towards shallow right. And the two-out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Now batting, Jordan Zimmerman. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. The 2 1. Waves and misses for strike number two. And he misses with that one down and in. It's a full count now, three and two. 
Brendan Sanger is on deck. Is put in play to the right side of the infield. Go to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. So stepping in, Brendan Sanger. Two hits in 13 at bats in the series so far. Fastball close, but he didn't get it. Two and one. In there, and it's even now. Two and two. Wow, not sure what they're looking for right there, but that one was pretty much middle, middle, center cut. Tough pitch to take. Adi pops it up, but this will land untouched. You're lucky if you get one pitch a night right down the middle. Cannot be laid on that fastball. Pops this one up. Ademan is there. Two gone. Striding forward now is the DH. Connor Justice will work on keeping this top of the second alive. Sent on the ground out to second. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Digging in the switch hitter, Jose Gutierrez took an 0 for 4 in the victory last night. The 1-2. Oh, that's off the plate. Ball two. Good eye to lay off the slider there, and he works it to full three and two here. Well, that sets up a big pitch right here, Matt, because you don't want to lose the leadoff guy in a scoreless game. It's tough to work around the leadoff walk. Digging in, Trent Jimbroni. Jimbroni. Timing just to tick off there as this one's fouled off to the right. The next three, two. Hit in the air down the left field line. And that will end up a foul ball. And he connects with it. This one's hit deep out to left center field. And that is off the wall. And they've really got something going here. Runners at second and third to start the inning. Batting it. The first baseman. All for throw. Riva. At the plate now, Alfonso Rivas. Now the fastball is right by him as he swings and misses for the first out of the inning. At the plate, Aramis Ademan. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. That misses, and we're even at two and two. Don't be surprised if he gets another back foot slider right here. Don't think for a second, just because he took the first one, that this pitcher won't come back exactly the same way. And that's through into left to base hit. The runner from third crosses the plate, and they've taken a one nothing lead. The bat, the right field. To the plate now, Roberto Caro. Ball three. Couldn't be a whole lot better situation to hit it now. Three and one, two on. He's got to be thinking he's going to get a pitch he can drive right here. Swing and a miss. Good pitch, and it's full now. Three and two. Liner in there for a base hit. Notch one in the score column as the runner from third crosses the plate. The no Into the box now. Zach Davis. Swing and he pops him up. Waldo Keen backs up and takes care of it. Two away. So coming to the plate, Ian Rice. Getting 500 in the series so far. Four for eight. One one home to third. Fielded cleanly. Throw on to first, and they're able to escape the monster inning as the side is retired. Yeah. 
in now Kevin Maiton as we are all set to begin the third inning in this one. Hey we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. Well off the plate with the change of pace that's ball two. Easy there big fella two and two. Proves the fastball there. This is hit high and deep out to straightaway center field. Gone to lead off the inning. Standing in now, Edwin Young. Now an off speed pitch gets the outside. It's a cold strike. Chopped in front of home plate. On to first, so a good bounce back pitch there as he gets the ground ball for the first out. Into the box now, Jack Kruger. One run in and one gone so far in this inning. Two and one. Ground ball left side. He's got it. On the first and a good stretch over there is going to get him by a step for the second out. The batter number nine. Striding into the box. Zane Gerwitz. 0 for 1 here in the early going. The 1 2. Tried to hold up there. Appeal down to first and no swing. It's ball two. Hit in the air out to left. Davis is under it and he makes the catch for out number three. Digging in for his second at bat, Christopher Morrell, as we move on to the bottom of inning number three. Into the windup, here's the two and one pitch. Drilled on the ground to short, reined in. And a bit of a high throw that time, but no problem over there at first as they record the out. At the plate, Brennan Davis. He flew out in his last at bat. 1 1. Is swung on and missed, and that's strike two. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Young is over to his right and he puts this one away for out number two. For the plate now is the designated hitter, Jose Gutierrez. He reached on a walk in his last time up and later came around to score. The 1-1 home. Taken low for ball four, and they'll have themselves a two out base runner here after all. Now batting. Stepping into the box, Trent Jimbroni. He scored a run after stroking a double in his first at bat. And he's got to build off that last AB. He battled. Usually, when you battle, you get in that swing mode. A lot of pitches, you'll swing. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. Riding in once again, Roberto Baldochin. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. The 3 and 1 pitch. Hey! The count is full, 3 and 2. And he takes strike 3 called on the fastball, one gone. Now in the box, Bo Wang. Fly down in his first at bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. 1 1. Line drive to left. 
And that's into the outfield for a one out hit. Now that the third baseman, Jordan Zimmerman. Oh, and they've got him picked off. And a good decision to throw as he is toast at second base. In now, Jordan Zimmerman. Ah, changed things up on him, and he got him to swing through it. One and two now. Thought this middle of the order might give him a fight and put up a little bit of resistance, but that hasn't been the case. He's carving right through them here. Here's another one, two. Fourth inning of a two to one ball game. Now here's one hit in the air to the right side. In there, a base hit. So a great job on a one and two pitch to keep the inning alive. The right fielder, number four, Brendan Banger. At the plate, Brendan Sanger. A ball and two strikes now. Yep, one and two. Weak grounder back to the mound. Throw in time, and the side is retired. Ready for another chance. Alfonso Rivas. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. This is pulled into right. But this is right at him in right field as he hardly has to move to take it in for the first out. Stepping up now, Arama Sadiman looking to follow up the RBI single from his first at bat. Down the left field line and deep. And that will end up a foul ball. Now the three and two pitch. Hard hit to first. Fielded cleanly. And an off balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. Now batter. Standing in, Roberto Caro. One for two on his line so far in the game. Slap hard the opposite way. And that's in there. So perhaps some life here with two men out. Throw over to first. And he'll dive back in safely. Caro is off of first with two away. Into the box. Zach Davis hit in the air down the left field line. And they can't run it down. The one two hit out towards second right to him on to second for the force out and the side is retired. Next will be the designated hitter Connor Justice. He'll start off the fifth in this one. One and one here it is. Hey, he's had great command all day. Want to see how aggressive he is in the zone with a three ball count. The three one. Up the middle and off his leg. And he'll get in there safely. To the plate now, Kevin Maiton. Good pitch there down below the zone. Got him to go after it. Great pitch in that situation. If he makes contact on that one, more than likely he's hitting into a double play. In the dirt here, but it won't skip away far enough for the runner to advance. Ready on two balls and two strikes. Here it comes. On a line to shortstop. And the runner gets back. No double play. Jarek Suter enters to make an appearance on the mound as he inherits a runner at first with one out in the inning. 
Edwin Yon will be the first to greet him here as he'll stand in with a runner at first and one away. 2-1, here it is. Takes this the other way to right, and that'll get down for a base hit. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. Now batting. The catcher. Jack. Stepping in now. Kruger. Jack Kruger. Turned on that one and crushed it. Just pulled it a little foul. And a full count as that misses. It's three and two now. Zane Gerwitz waits on deck. Hit the other way out toward right field. Right fielder giving chase. He makes the catch, and the runner from second will tag and hit for third. And he'll make it up safely to third, so they're at the corners now with two men out. So striding in, Zane Gerwitz, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. Tried to hold up there. Appeal down to first, and no swing. It's ball two. The 2-2 two -two pitch. 3-2, two, three, two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. And here's a ball hit in the air. And no one will track it down. Here's the payoff pitch. Hit down the third baseline. Scooped up. And the off-balance throw gets him as he takes away a hit, and the side is retired. Jose Rodriguez, a six-foot, two-inch right-hander, jogs in to take over on the mound. Set now for the bottom of the fifth. Striding in, Ian Rice. He got on top of one and was a ground-out victim last time. One one is swung on and missed for strike number two. And this is pop foul, but perhaps playable behind first. He dives, but he can't make the catch. It's a foul ball. Again, a one two. And that's a swinging strike three in the dirt. And the throw is there to record the first out. So here's the cleanup hitter, Christopher Morrell. He was a ground out victim last time up. Well below the knees, laid off on the change up there. Hit to third, reined in. In time to first, and there are two away. So digging in now, Brennan Davis. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One -one. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. He's got it. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. The sixth about to get started. Stepping in, Roberto Balderkin. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Yeah, Matty, and hopefully he got it out of his system. Especially now, he's got to bear down. He gets the two strikes in this spot, has to put the ball in play. Off the outside that time as the breaking ball can't catch the zone. Not a time to fool around right now on a 3-2 count with the middle part of the order coming up. Expect a good pitch to swing at. Swing, line, drive. That's going to be trouble. Legs churning. He's headed for second. But that'll be off the wall in right center. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. Now that the center fielder goes well. 
at the plate now. Bo Wayne. And this one runs a little too far in. Ball two. Unable to get the bat around in time, and the count evens at two and two. Lifted down the line in left. Left fielder is on the move, and they can't run it down. It's going to be back to some serious T work if he can't put that pitch in play right in his wheelhouse. Lifted the other way out to left center. Left fielder giving chase. He grabs it, but the tying run is going to try for third. And a daring move there pays off as he'll make it into third on the fly ball to left. Number five. So striding forward now, Jordan Zimmerman. It was a single for him in his last at bat. The 1 1. Big sweeping breaking ball right there. Good pitch. But if he wants to get him to swing at it, he'll have to bring it in a little bit closer to the strike zone. And that misses off the plate and low, so it's three and one now. Hey, after those two breaking balls missed, you have to be sitting on a fastball right here. Fastball in there, three and two. I'm absolutely shocked he took that pitch right there. Right in the wheelhouse, low 90s heater. That's one you've got to let go on. Hit hard towards center. And he has delivered on three and two as he comes up big. It's a base hit. And they've come back to tie it up as it's now a 2 2 ball now game. Back. The right fielder, Brendan Sanger. So now to the plate, Brendan Sanger. Swing and a miss on the fastball that time, out number two. Now back. At the plate, Connor hit. Justice, a Connor. hit in two tries so no. far. Now a throw over to first, runners back. Even at a ball and a strike. Here's the pitch. There's a breaking ball that couldn't quite catch the inside. High pop-up. Rivas is there to make the catch, and the side is retired. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. Into the box now, Jose Gutierrez. It was a walk in his last trip. Line hard, but foul. The 2-2. Line to the right side. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. In now, Trent Jimboni. And they'll go off speed here as this pitch misses. It's two and one. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. But this will wind up a foul ball. Two and two. Not where he wanted that fastball to be, and it's three and two now. No pitcher likes to take the count to three and two, especially when you throw a non-competitive pitch like that on two and two. That one wasn't even close. Go to first is in time for the first down. Ready for another shot now. Alfonso Rivas. He lined out in his last trip, so looking for better fortunes here. Yeah, Matty, it's always a little frustrating when you square one up. You hit a solid line drive like he did, and all you have to show for it is a jog back to the dugout. That can get in your head for a little while. He's set, and the 2-1 pitch fouled off. Runner at second here with one man out. Hit sharply on the ground. Oh, and he has some trouble with it. Into the box, Aramis Ademan grounded back up the middle. One there, 
On to first as they get the double play to get him out of the inning. Bailey Clark is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 43. Bailey. Digging in once again, Kevin Maiton. He'll swing it from the left side right here. And this is the side of the plate this guy loves to hit at. Hitting over 350 left-handed, hitting against right-handed pitching. And he lays off for a ball, two and one. Now a curveball here, nowhere close. That's in the dirt. It's three and one. When you're playing close games like this, base runners mean everything, so he can ill afford to start giving away free passes. Carl is there to put it away for route number one. Digging in and looking for more, Edwin Young. He singled in two trips to the plate thus far. The one two. Into right field, that's a base hit. At the plate, Jack Cougar. Runners off for second. Swung on and lifted in the air to left center. Left fielder giving chase. He gets there and makes the play for the second out of the inning. So the batting order turns over now and set to go Zane Gerwitz. He's hitless in three at bats to this point. Takes this the other way to right. And that finds a seam for extra bases as we'll see if they want to wheel that go-ahead run home from first. So now they'll have two men in scoring position following the two-out double. Now back, the football, Roberto Baldekin. Into the box now, Roberto Baldekin changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for the ball. Too high that time, and it's three and one. Big pitch here. I mean, you know the guy at the plate is gearing up for something to hit, so executing a good pitch right here is essential. Out of the stretch, the three two home. Grounder down the line at third, but this will get foul, so they'll do it again. Three and two. Ready with the payoff pitch. And he misses with it for ball four. So the bases will be loaded now with two away. Ready once again. Bo away. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. The set and the one one. The ball in two strikes. Two out, bases loaded. Fouled away. Strikes him out. So a missed opportunity at the plate as he strands three runners and the side is retired. Kyle Keller gets the draw from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seven. Now back to the top of the lineup. Stepping in, Roberto Caro. So far, two for three in this one. The 1-1. One, one. Takes a pitch for strike number two. Cue shot here out towards short. And one gone. Digging in now, Zach Davis. He could really use a knock here 0 for 3 in the game so far. Now the 1-1 one and one pitch. Count moves to a ball and two strikes now. Bases are empty, one man out. Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. Stepping into the box, Ian Rice. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right, and that'll move the count to 1 and 2 now. Here's the pitch. Now a ball hit in the air to straightaway left. This is carrying well out of here.
to the plate now. Christopher Morrell lifted in the air out towards left center. Center fielder on the run. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Ben Hatton has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Leading off the inning, Jordan Zimmerman, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. This thing's far from over, even though we're moving into the back end of this game. Only down by one. All they need to do is get this leadoff guy, and they're an extra base hit away from tying this thing up. He's fallen behind now, three and one. Great situation right here, leading off the inning. You've got to find a way to get on base any way possible. But I don't like to take the aggression away from hitters. If it's in your zone, I want you swinging. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. The right field. Settling in right now, field. Brendan Sanger. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. The 2-2. Back up the middle. And that finds its way into center for a one-out base hit. The back of the cup. So now to the plate, Connor Justice seared down the first baseline. This one, everything we could have hoped for, three to two in inning number eight. Line drive to center field. Davis will have plenty of room as he makes the catch, and there's a big out number two. Now to the plate, Kevin Maiton is working on a one for three thus far. Swing and a ball line hard towards short. Leaps and makes a terrific catch. And with that, the side is retired. Brett Hanowitz is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eight. Bottom of inning number eight set to go. Coming to the plate now, Brennan Davis. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Hit on the ground out to short. And there's one away. Ready now, Jose Gutierrez. He singled his last time up. Misses, ball two. One out, nobody on. Grounded to the right. Oh, look at the sliding stop. Got him. Digging in, Trent Jimboni. He was a ground out victim last time up. Jimboni. 1-1. Runs a bit inside for a ball. Pretty good pitch right there. Fastball in off the plate. One of the things you want to do as a pitcher, try to stand those hitters up. Fastball is looked at for strike two. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. Here's a little chopper up the middle. Off-balance throw gets him. Nice play there as the side is retired. Corey Black comes out of the bullpen to shut things down here in the ninth. Number 50. New inning set to get underway. Now at the plate, Edwin Young. Last time through was a base hit. From the windup, the 1-1 one -one pitch. Swing and a ball lifted in the air toward the line and right. And a great diving effort there, but it'll just tip off his glove, and it's a base hit. And this will wind up a closer play than I thought, but he's in there with two bases. Now batting. The catcher. Jack. Hugo. Standing in now, Jack Kruger. Swinging a soft liner. And the throw to first is in time. One gun. So stepping in, Zane Gerwitz. As he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Gerwitz. And a fastball. Blew it right by him, and there are two down. Coming to the plate now, Roberto Baldoquin. They'll go to work on getting that tying run home from second. One and one. Here it is. 
And this is swung on and missed. So now they find themselves down to their final strike tonight. Struck him out. So he'll strand the possible tying run at second. And a great job of working out of trouble as this ball game is over. You can just see that the confidence is radiating off of them out there right now. That's six wins in a row. And this looks like a train that's not about to slow down anytime soon. Three to two, the finish in tonight's game. The Tennessee Smokies jumped ahead in the seventh inning and never gave the lead back. Bailey Clark earns his third win of the year in relief. Corey Black hammers down the save, his sixth. So that'll put a wrap on things here this evening. For my partners, Dan Plezak and Mark DeRosa, I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a special presentation of MLB The Show. For more, follow us on Twitter at MLB The Show. for the victorious Murphy. Three runs on seven hits. No error as they left eight men on base. For the Trash Panthers, two runs on 11 hits. No error as they left nine runners on base. Time of the ball game, two hours and 48 minutes. Thank you for joining us here tonight. And we remind you to please drive home safely.